State. There are 30 films screening at the uh, first, or well, the inaugural, Samford International Film Festival. And while many of them are made right here in the U.S. and around the world, 19 of this year's films are made right here in Maine. That's fantastic. Our news aide's Katie Thompson live in Samford with a closer look at that. Hey there, Katie. What a great event. Hey, Norm. Good morning. 37 films are being featured over today and tomorrow here in Samford, the first ever event of its kind, the Samford International Film Festival. It's drawing filmmakers from all over the state, New England, and the world. More close to 20 of the films were shot right here in Maine, but there were some that are coming from as far as New Zealand, Australia, France, England. The mastermind behind all of this, filmmaker and teacher at Sanford High School, James Harmon, joining me now. James, you put this whole thing together in two months. Talk about what the push was behind this idea. The, it started with our film hashtag YOLO. Uh, we were supposed to have our world premiere at the Lewiston Auburn Film Festival, but that fell apart at the last minute. So we thought we'd do something local. And when the cancellation email went out, we decided to invite all those filmmakers to come to Sanford and screen. A lot of interest there. So since then, we met with the mayor, and he was very supportive of the idea. Things have really taken off. Um, and let's, volunteers all over the place helping out. Exactly. Let's talk about your film, Hashtag YOLO. A lot of help from your students at Sanford High School as well with this. I was reading a little bit about the plot. Sounds like uh, high school seniors who are trying to make a list of things they want to do before they graduate. This is obviously a timely movie. And uh, YOLO, you only live once. The phrase that's kind of been uh, the phrase of the year. And of course, hashtags, we all know what that means. But Talk about the film a little bit. Um, well, the, the idea for the name was sort of a joke, and we figured that it kind of sticks. It's got the hashtag. Maybe, maybe we can be trending by the end of all of this. <laughs> um, but it was a summer film project. Seven kids signed up for a class, and we made a film for credit. They wrote it, cast it in less than 10 days, and then we shot um, over 22 days and then edited uh, fall semester. So it's been a crazy process. And all volunteers for that too. So that kind of showed us that we could do this uh, film festival thing because there was so much energy behind that. Um, so it's been wonderful. Hashtag YOLO is one of the first films showing today. What are the different venues and times people can come down and check out some of these movies? We're starting at City Hall Auditorium right up there at 10 o'clock and also at Curtis Lake Church at 10 o'clock. Uh, the Nassau Little Theater right down the street in Springvale. That opens up at 1 o'clock for movies. $10 for 37 movies. You were saying this is the best value. I think it's the best value in film festival history. Uh, the 37 movies, entrance to the filmmaker reception this evening at St. Ignatius Gym, and discounts at 30 shops and restaurants for the whole month of June in Sanford. Wow. That is incredible. Congratulations on the success of getting this whole thing pulled together so quickly. James Harmon, he has hashtag YOLO premiering today here in Sanford, all part of the Sanford International Film Festival. Norm, this is a really, really cool event. Yeah, well, he's calling it the greatest deal in the history of film. You, you can't disagree there, considering the price for a single movie is almost, you know, 12 bucks or so. That's, uh, that's a very good deal, Katie. That's what I was going to say. You can't even see a film if you're not going to, you know, a matinee for ten dollars. So I know. it's a great deal. This is two days, 37 movies. I don't even think you could rent that many on, you know, <laughs> Amazon for that much. No, you can't. What a deal, right? Yeah. All right. Thanks, Katie. See you back in a few minutes.